How y'all doing? We're over here at KnobCon number nine with Mr. Fred Becker. And uh, yeah, just I, I saw you had this really cool instrument here and you're also a keynote speaker. And so just really wanted to pick your brain a little bit and talk about what you're here for. Yeah, I've, um, I'm one of the original purchases of this uh, vintage uh, digital synthesizer called the Synergy, which uh, uses additive synthesis to create sound. Yeah. And um, after about five years, the original company that makes this went out of business. So um, about 20 years ago, I started users groups for people that own these for support. And um, we've been doing various ways of keeping these things going. Some of our members make computer boards to replace these boards and so on. And uh, just recently, a couple of our members have created a software version of, of Synergy, basically uh, got the Synergy original software working in an emulator environment and then also the Capro computer, which interface with the Synergy working on a PC. So now the whole thing is available on a laptop and we have it available as a free download. Wow. Yeah. That, that, that's that, that's uh, just such an amazing thing to hear, you know, that you're able to preserve some of that heritage and share yeah. it with new generations. And uh, So what, what was one of the first things that drew you to the, to the Synergy? Yeah, I was just getting about ready to start making music. I was really into getting a synthesizer and one day, I saw an ad for the Synergy in Omni Magazine. And I started saving my money and finally got one, so I was one of the original buyers. And, and, and uh, how much was that, if you don't mind me asking? It was about four, $4,500, wow. about 40 years ago. Yeah, yeah. so pretty so, penny. And it was a total gamble also. I, I just knew that I loved it, but I did not actually know if it would be useful for me or not. So, so you, so you right. went in without having actually played one, right? and, and you just went full I did, in. I did see a demo by Tom Piggott, yeah. who was one of the company spokespersons at a music store. It looked pretty good, yeah. so I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, it looks like you made the right choice. I was going to say, eventually I lucked out and it was very useful. I've now created over 100 albums with wow. it. Wow. And these are some of my Over albums. 100 albums. Yeah. That, that, is, that is just insane. Can, yeah. Can you tell me a little bit about the interface that we have here? Okay, yeah. So I just have a uh, electric panel keyboard mm -hmm. for controlling of this. But this is the Synergy software for the Synergy. And this is Synergize software for the K Pro computer. And they talk to one another so you can voice it yourself and do additive synthesis it has 32 oscillators and you can program different algorithms it's very similar to the dx7 fm synthesis okay. in fact you can import dx7 voices into this really and edit them that is awesome yeah and so if someone would yeah. like to download this vst where would they go it's uh the web link is uh right here it's on github okay. and there's the synergy is one and synergy jives is the other one awesome Yep, and so Synergize was made by Steve Tyner, and Synergy was made by Yari or Jari Klimola. Wow. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you for spending some time with us today. Yeah, I'm glad to have shared this here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thanks for sharing. <laughs>